I'm Michelle Linden Mayer and in this video I'm going to show you how to cover chipboard with pattern paper. Chipboard has revolutionised the scrapbooking world and we're now blessed with an array of gorgeous alphabets in every font and size imaginable and shapes like flowers, hearts and even brackets. The great thing about chipboard is that you can customise it to suit your needs. One great way of doing this is to cover your chipboard with pattern paper. This is one way of making sure that your page is totally coordinated. What you'll need, you'll need a chipboard letter or shape, some pattern paper, Hermodotto adhesive, a craft knife and a self-healing mat or glass cutting mat. First choose a piece of chipboard that you would like to use. Today I'm going to be using an alphabet letter. Now select your pattern paper and turn it over so that the pattern you would like to use is face down. Then take a piece of chipboard and apply some adhesive to the top or right side of the chipboard. Today I'm using Hermodotto adhesive so that I don't have to wait for it to dry. Now take your chipboard and stick it down onto the pattern paper. If it's a letter, it should appear back to front. You can now take your chipboard and pattern paper and place it onto your cutting mat with the chipboard facing up. Today I'm going to be using a glass cutting mat as it helps the craft knife to cut more smoothly. Take a craft knife and carefully cut around your piece of chipboard, staying as close to the chipboard as possible. When you've cut all the way around your chipboard, you can turn it over to see the finished product. Now you have a chipboard letter in a customised pattern paper that will match your layout. A little tip, if you have any rough edges on your chipboard, you can use a sanding block or low grade sandpaper to gently smooth the edges. I'm Michelle for Scrapbook TV. Happy scrapping!